Good morning. My name is Jack McElroy, and in just a couple of weeks, we're planning an unprecedented evangelistic outreach, and we couldn't be more excited. A dedicated six-member team representing our church will be visiting every home and business in Groton, Pepperell, and Brookline, New Hampshire. The team will include Pastor Montel Wilder, myself, and four others. When we knock on a door and meet the residents, Pastor Wilder will begin by asking a simple but profound question. Are you afraid of dying? It's a question many people have on their minds but rarely discuss. After that, Pastor Wilder will share that we have a book that has helped many people overcome their fear of death and would like to give them a copy as a free gift from our church if they're interested. At that point, Pastor Wilder will introduce me as the author, and I'll tell them the following stories from my youth. When I was 12 years old, mom talked about a 19-year-old girl who was killed in a head-on crash near our home. Mom said the guy drove into her on purpose. It wasn't like TV. This was real. I was shocked. Now she was gone. But where did she go? I couldn't stop thinking about it. That same summer, Grandpa told me, Jackie, I think I'm going to die soon. He was sitting at the kitchen table, looking down at his swollen feet. He had heart problems. And I said, oh, Grandpa, don't say that. A few months later, Mom picked us up at school and said, I have some sad news. Grandpa died this morning. You know, he was only 62. But where did he go? He was gone. In my late teens, a friend suggested skydiving. I said yes, so I wouldn't look like a chicken. But I remember lying in my bed, frozen with fear that the chute wouldn't open and I'd plunge to my death. And then what? Anyway, once I've shared my stories and the other four members of our team will talk about how the book has personally impacted their lives. It's amazing to hear their perspectives on how this message has made a difference. Anyway, Pastor Ma Wilder will then share one of his favorite aspects of the book, uh, how it doesn't insult anyone's religious beliefs, and how it tells you how to overcome the fear of death right now. After that, Pastor Wilder will guide them to our landing page where they can either download the book for free or request a hard copy to be delivered to their home. The book itself is engaging, telling a compelling story while clearly and urgently presenting the gospel. And that's not where it ends. Pastor Wilder will follow up with 14 emails that continue to share the gospel and invite readers to reach out to him personally. Now, of course, we can't physically visit every home or business. But this imagery does give you a sense of what we can achieve using a simple postcard as our substitute. Postcards have a unique advantage over letters in that they don't need to be opened. And statistics show that postcards have a read rate of approximately 80 to 90 percent simply because of their visibility and concise message. With this strategy, we hope to have the opportunity to share our message with over 8,000 people. If you all pray and ask the Lord to open hearts, imagine what impact we can make.